hey what is up guys today we'll be discussing about the iOS 8.0.2 update that Apple has just released earlier today so basically what this release is it's basically a new patch for the 8.0.1 update that Apple released the day before which basically caused more problems than the 8.0 firmware so basically 8.0.2 just patches the um, some little problems that the iPhone 6 and iPhone 6 plus experienced like let's say uh, inability to use the touch ID fingerprint sensor and the lack of cellular connection which just pretty much bricks the entire device and your device is literally like a brick so of course we're gonna go through all the iOS 8.0.2 features that um, what Apple improved and it's quite a bit so yeah let's just take a little look here so of course it fixes a uh, 8.0.1 that impacted cellular network connectivity and touch ID on the new models of the iPhone 6 and 6 plus so basically what this means that uh, you know it just fixes up uh, what what they have uh, cost in 8.0.1 which uh, uh, just breaks your device uh, your, your cellular network is not available in 8.0.1 and touch ID doesn't work so of course it fix a bug so health kit apps can be made available on the app store so now you can download health kit apps on the app store and it addresses an issue where the third party keyboards could become deselected when a user entered their passcode so yeah that is pretty self explanatory self explanatory or whatever it's just pretty much uh, really common sense and yeah it fixes issue where it some prevented some apps from assessing photos so yeah just you know fixes the little bugs in here and there improve the reliability of reachability which is the double tap on the home button thing on the iPhone 6 and 6 plus and then you could fix up quite a bit with the cellular data and stuff like that and it has better support for family sharing in App Store and of course um, you know you get more of that little fix fixes here and there so of course um, this update is available to download in iTunes right now or you can up you can update through the your device over the air and yeah this is quite a good update and for jailbreaking uh, we haven't really heard much from the evasion and pangu team but um, I hope that you know a jailbreak will be coming out soon so yeah so this is a really really simple video explaining 8.0.2 and how it is related to jailbreaking so if you guys are waiting for the jailbreak on iOS 8 you are still safe to update it to 8.0.2 you don't need to like stay on 8.0 for the jailbreak or whatever iOS 8 jailbreak or whatever. You know you update to 8.0.2 and you can still get the jailbreak uh, when Pangu and Evasion uh, releases one in the future. So of course I really hope you guys enjoyed this little quick and summarized summarized video of the 8.0.2 update. And yeah, hope to hope you guys enjoyed this video and of course peace out guys. Yeah.